Hello everyone. In today's video, I'm going to show you a Katana inventory management tutorial for beginners. Now this video will have everything you need to get started with Katana on inventory management. So without further ado, let's dive right into their website. So here we have the Katana inventory management dashboard. This is what you'll get to see once you sign up for their free trial. As you can see here, uh, your free trial period ends in 14 days. So everyone gets to have uh, 14 days worth of free trial before you're going to need to activate a subscription to carry on with your account. So for their subscriptions, uh, let's check this out real quick. That did not go as planned. There we go. So they have a starter subscription with the price of $199 per month and you have all these inclusions so unlimited users SKUs and integrations one inventory location up to 1200 sales orders per year and as much as $600,000 GMV per year and these features as well so you have sales and purchase order management contact management items management basic manufacturing real-time inventory planner, live chat, and email support. You can also choose their annual plan right here for... Uh, basically, it saves you $20, as you can see, $199 per month. But here, it's as if you're going to be billed at $179 per month. And it's going to be around $2,148 per year. And your bill is going to come every after a year. All right, so that's what they have for their subscriptions. Now, uh, to get started with Katana first, just uh, type in katanamrt.com on your browser, and then you can either get a demo or start with a free trial. So if you want a demo first, then feel free to check this out. I believe you just need to fill in some details right here. And then you can book your own demo. You can uh, have a personalized demo that fits your business needs. But again, if you just want to explore yourself, just go for their free trial and follow the prompts. And after you've done that, you'll, uh, you'll land on this page right here. So they've actually put together a checklist to walk us through the steps to set your account or to set our account. So before we get started on that, uh, Katana Inventory Management is basically a cloud-based platform designed for manufacturers, artisans, and growing businesses to streamline production, inventory, and order management. It's particularly popular with small and medium-sized businesses in manufacturing. Katana is also ideal for businesses looking to modernize their manufacturing operations and gain full visibility into their production processes while integrating seamlessly with existing tools and workflows. So let's try to go through their uh, walkthrough here. But first, uh, let's uh, briefly check and observe what we have here on our dashboard. These are sample data that they present us with. It comes with a free trial. So we have a bunch of lists in this uh, uh, dashboard. These are sales orders. We also have do we also have sample quotes? We don't. We don't have sample quotes. So we have sales orders. And they have different statuses. So in stock, expected on this date, not available. All right, not shipped. Let's try to check the done tab. Here are the ones that are delivered. So it's going to give you an idea of how it looks when you have a sales order delivered. Okay, so let's move on to the guided walkthrough. So here, they have a list. Take a quick tour, verify settings, invite teammates, import products. So uh, again, if you want an assisted, uh, a more assisted approach into exploring, then feel free to try this out as well. 
one minute tour the sell screen gives you a real-time view of your sales orders and whether you have enough inventory and materials to fill them stock screen is where you track stock levels which update as you use materials or make sales the item screen manages all your products and materials including profit margins and cost prices the contact screen stores customer and supplier info this way they can be automatically added to orders the plan screen helps you forecast sales and manage inventory so you stay in stock and maximize sales the buy screen helps you to manage purchasing you can see and create purchase orders here like what we see in this dashboard and the make screen is where you plan productions production rather you can check manufacturing orders ingredient availability and production status and then finally for settings this is where you get uh, where you set things like your base currency units of measure and tax rates it's also where you connect your e-commerce and accounting platforms so that's uh what we have briefly for the entire software of katana let's check out our list now uh first thing you need to do of course is to have your account set up properly or your settings configured so here take a few minutes and click through all settings got it of course locations uh adding location is important so just navigate here under locations so that you can input your manufacturing or storage sites so enter them here Let's check out their integ integrate tools, integrations. So right here we have the integrations. Here are some of the platforms or e-commerce platforms you can connect. So Big Commerce, Shopify, WooCommerce, Intuit, QuickBooks, Cero, and some other third party. So these ones are built by Katana. These are the third party uh, integrations. We have the two ship fulfillment by Amazon, Amazon Seller Central, Big Commerce, Extensive, Easy Insight, eBay, Equid, Etsy, Fair, FCC Accounting System, HubSpot, Integrately, Jico or Jico, not sure if I pronounced that correctly, Make, Magento, Outvio. Allery, Pipe17, Pipedrive, Salesforce, and so on. It's a very extensive list right here, as you can see. And here, if you can't find an integration that you need, you can actually configure your own using Katana AI API as well. So feel free to check that out so that you can link uh, your own e-commerce or have your own integration set up. So let's head back to our sales order page I'm just gonna show you real quick how to add products and materials so let's look at the create a product section so this should be under the items uh, section all right so here you just click on the plus product or add product and then there we go so just add in the details so the product name sku and other details necessary this is how you do it just access items and then the add product then fill in the necessary details now for raw materials it should be here as well right here on the tab materials we can add a material here and then similar with adding a product just fill in the details and then once you're done just uh, have it saved and then you'll have that new material listed into your katana and that's it for today thanks for tuning in and i'll see you next time